Trust me, you won't see him running yeah, lofty in many C finals, that, will you? Is, that's, <laughs> isn't that nice, the Ralph Lennish t shirt to Ryan like that? Isn't that nice? Let <laughs> the guys share wardrobes like that. <laughs> Pretty, never, never ceases to surprise me. Well, I think one thing, and, and we had a chance to to talk to Ryan in Shanghai just uh, over the weekend, Rowdy, and you, you find out, I mean, look, he's a, he's a unique man. He's got his own style, and you love that about him. And then you love the fact that when he gets in the water, I mean, the, the effort and the work, and my, I think there's been no greater compliment than the fact that Michael Phelps, almost every comment he's made recently has been about how much he has to work, knowing how hard he has to push. Here's the bar that Ryan Lochte set. I think Ryan Lochte, in the end will be the best thing for Michael Phelps because you you make a great point. I don't think Michael, if he didn't have Ryan, would necessarily work that hard here coming up this next year. And now he will. And they, they've they helped each other, right? We, we saw it in Shanghai where swimmers in that 200 IM said that it was Michael that pushed Ryan to set what became being a world record. Sure, they, they've helped each other. There's no question, but I think Ryan has helped Michael even more than Michael Maybe right now, you're saying. Yes, right, right now, definitely. Now, now we're watching Michael in this. Let, let's keep an eye on the B final, which is coming up. Ed Moses, Ryan and Ed, very very good friends. And Ed is making a comeback himself. And he had a little Lucky small good. wager. Not sure good. what it is, but a little small wager on who's going to be faster in the Hunter Brustroke. And we'll have to keep the times going. Mine was telling me about that. He said he really wants to swim well here in the 100 breaststroke because it means everything trying to beat Ed Moses. Lochte is fourth from the top. And looks to have a, a slight edge here coming in. Right Although there. he's getting a push here. Well, this is gonna come right down to the touch. Let's see who gets under there first. And it is Scott Welts that got the win in 102-2. Lochte a tenth of a second behind. Just a little bit faster than he went in the prelims, but boy, he's gonna have his work yeah. cut out for him beating <laughs> beating Ed Moses. Ed came in with a 102.54, so right now he's ahead of him. Here's the finish right there. Ryan just starting to tighten up just a little bit toward the end, to be expected, obviously. What an incredibly tough day, last day he had. Just talk about Elizabeth Beisel, and he had to swim the 400 IM as well just a couple of days ago.